changing out the bathroom floor you want to tell them why or any of that um well we were going to go with this and we always assumed it was going to be a temporary thing um we went with more higher end laminate flooring peel and stick because it's going to be vinyl 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 it uh feels more comfortable and it's going to look a lot better so and then we'll actually be uh, putting walls up everywhere here shortly. So, lots going on on the inside of the house as well as outside. Our greenhouse plastic finally should be here tomorrow. But this is what we had. And this is what we're going to. We're pretty excited about that. It was a good deal. It was on sale um, for 69 cents when we got the other flooring there at Lowe's. When we went to St. Louis, if you haven't seen that video, it's the one right uh, before this. So go back and check that out. I'm getting prepared here. As you can see, we started to get some of our waters and feeders and our gardening stuff and our greenhouse plastic we came to Hirsch feed it's about that time we are going to start preparing our brooders because we have a lot a lot a lot a lot of babies coming to the homestead shortly in just a few weeks We are at Walmart getting these brooders coming soon. Came home to Amazon. We got our soil meter. Don't mind this. This is pre garden chaos. I've got stacked up right here. Pretty excited. We're going to be doing um, that when I'm done with this. And I got my twist ties so I can tie my plants up. And these, Amazon told me, were not going to come. And they refunded me. But then they showed up today. And they said I could keep them. These are grow bags for my potatoes. Um, it's part of my, um, well, one of the ways I'm going to grow potatoes this year. So, super pumped about that. There is five of them, I believe. And so, um... Yeah, just really exciting. And I think we're going to do towers and we're going to do raised bed as well for potatoes. Okay, we are going to start a few seeds because we are antsy pantsy. We're actually going to be doing a video tomorrow on the greenhouse. Hopefully we can get the cattle panels here because uh, the snow is gone and we're going to be working on that. Um, this is my little table. I have like gardening everything. I have gardening stuff everywhere. Um, so we're just going to plant something fun. Um, you know, just something for us to get started. We haven't used these before. These are those um, peat. Let me show you. Well, I got a little one here. We have, oh, can you see? We have these. And then these ones are just the more cells but they're exactly the same with the pellets so we're gonna go and pick out a seed from our 
big buck and see what we can't get started today. I'm going to pick something for half and he's going to pick something for half. Last year uh, we started doing this where we just picked something fun and that was the very first thing that we planted before we got crazy serious with doing everything and so that's what we're going to be doing today. Okay, we decided on, go ahead and lift him up and say the name so I'm not being... Weird. We're going to do um, Merlot Hybrid. They're going to be Purple Black Sweet Bells. The, that was his pick. And then my other two picks are the Lemon Spice Jalapenos and the Red Creole Onion. And then I'm doing... Um, she's going to do Brad's Atomic Grape Tomato. Uh, big red pepper and the bell star broccoli and this is from totally tomatoes territorial seed baker creek totally tomatoes baker creek and Haas tools and this is going to be the start day one of the 2021 single seed challenge i will mark which one is this seed for the challenge using these marker marks that came with it so that way we can track exactly which seed is going to happen let's hopefully it'll be great um we're gonna just we just start a bunch of randomness and we split it up and uh we'll be hopefully finishing the greenhouse tomorrow and everything's gonna be going out there and we're gonna do a whole bunch of actual seeds starting. This is just something fun we do where we each pick three and we plant um, six cells each and it's just something that we love to do. The seeds are so tiny. These are the Brad's Atomic. They're tiny. I think it said that there was 15. Yeah, 15 seeds in here. So I'm pretty pumped. Let's see if we can. Scoot it over here. He went to get me a marker. It says to just loosely do it and try to squeeze fluff. Accidentally, accidentally got two there. We'll just plop that in there. And this was all pre-moistened. Um, there we go. That is my first one. And I'm going to make the little stick now so that we're aware... I encourage everyone to just have a little fun with it. We like to do something. I know some people are very, very serious, and that's good. But we just like to have a little fun. Now I'm just going to stick that in there so that it says single seed, Brad's Atomic. And now we'll show you when we're done. Okay, we're done. We've got our uh, lettuce in from outside also but we've got our stuff here it's on a heat mat and we are excited getting ready the lighting is terrible because we're inside today i have these soaking in a bowl over on the table because it's, you got to soak these for 24 hours we have a couple different kinds uh one, it, you can direct seed or start them indoors. If you start them indoors, it's supposed to be two to three months. Um, it's a little different if you have um, a greenhouse too. So I got tons of different feedback and I decided, I guess I'll try everything. This is a perennial and uh, we really love asparagus. I have a bunch of different kinds and I did, uh, I got quite a bit of this colossal. So I'm going to try to soak some, keep some in here, direct seed some outside um, later on in the months, and also um, start some in, in the greenhouse. So we'll see how everything turns out. 
tomorrow our video will be of some greenhouse work as well as a little bit of what is our garden going to be where are we going to put it now everything is melted down so we are going to be able to get everything placed and so i'm going to be walking everybody through that um and through the greenhouse and i will be showing the other projects we've got going on and catching everybody up to go full swing we have a lot going on this week so stay tuned super nice that all the snow and everything that went into our barrels is starting to melt and we are getting quite a lot mm -hmm. 